Before I could put the underlayment down, I had to touch up the laying down of the poly that my general contractor's crew had done before. They were there's a little bit of confusion about whether or not it needed to go all the way to the wall and whether or not it needed to be secured. And so I had to go back and get everything to the wall, get it all secured and make sure that it would be able to pass the inspection. So this is kind of the fast forward of what I did. So you can see I taped around all the pipes, taped it all the way to the wall and made sure that everything was covered. I just tested positive for COVID this morning. As you can tell, I don't sound great. Um, but I'm here at the house working because I need to get the, uh, the pads down for the in-floor heat by Monday because there's an inspection on Monday. <laughs> and um, yeah, I don't really have any choice in the matter because if we have to reschedule the inspection, it's gonna have to be rescheduled for at least like a week and a half, two weeks out, cause that's how far they are out. So I'm, uh, I'm all hopped up on um, coffee and cops, cough medicine and ibuprofen. Uh, luckily ibuprofen has a pretty, pretty big range before you get into a poisonous dose. Uh, if you're human, if you're a dog or a cat, it's actually quite dangerous if you are a dog or a cat watching this do not ask your human to give you ibuprofen because it will be the last and worst decision you ever make so yeah luckily these pads are they're pretty light so I don't it's not gonna take a whole lot of energy it's just gonna I just have to cut some of them to get them into place and to fit them around all the pipes and whatnot so yeah, <laughs> I had a good run, two, two and a half years without getting COVID. And now just before I have to do a whole bunch of uh, really, really important stuff, I get it. So that's just uh, how luck works. So uh, wish me luck today. So the instructions got soaked. So this is gonna be interesting. Um, the easiest work in that right oh, crap. Um, right. <clears throat> kind of changes my plan a little bit because I was planning on starting on this side where all the pipes are. Um, but I guess we'll at least do the first row or two and then we'll we'll get back to that. But then that means I gotta move all these stacks. All right, I guess I'll, I guess I'll just have to move on.
here you'll see me trying to use my layers of level to line up the pad so I could cut the holes for these pipes coming out of the ground. Unfortunately, as you'll see in a little bit, I was not successful. I didn't realize it, but at this point I had a fever of over 100 and I was just not thinking clearly or making the best decisions. So that could have also been why it wasn't as successful, even though I was trying to make sure that everything lined up, but unfortunately it just didn't work as well as I had hoped.
So there is the first and probably hardest row done just because of all the pipes and everything. So still have a few more things to work around, but not nearly, not nearly as many as this one. So hopefully the rest should go at least a little bit easier. And then compared to all this, the putting stuff in the bedroom will be hopefully a piece of cake. that was both the most amazing most amazing thing I've ever done and also the most stupid because yeah I'm tired <laughs> I'm really tired I drank a lot of water I need to get a Gatorade from upstairs oh. I'm not really going to do much tomorrow I'm going to have to come back here and kind of do some cleanup because I don't have the stuff I need.